When you open positions pre-market, is it just as easy to open and close positions? No, and it's um, quite dangerous, really, uh, if you don't kind of understand the dynamics of that. Uh, because uh, during pre-market or after hours, uh, you can't create a market order. So you can't buy and sell stocks no matter what price they're at instantly. You have to specify a price. It's called a limit order, right? And uh, and the problem is uh, when when the price is starting to move, uh, you you're going to be always a, a second behind. You know, you're going to be typing or changing the limit order to whatever particular price. You click send, and then you missed it because it was it was already going up uh, or down, right? If you're trying to get a low price, whatever it is, you know. You're, you're going to be ending up like doing a kind of a chasing process like that. So that's one of the things you have to realize is that uh, you have to set limit orders in pre-market and uh, after hours. Also, you have to change what's called TIF, time and force, your order, what period of time it's supposed to be in force. You have to change it uh, to on your brokerage, whatever that would be, uh, like in Thinkorswim, we have extended hours, or we can do pre-market or after hours. Um, and then there's market or day, you know, good for the day. Day doesn't count after hours and pre-market. Day only counts market. Uh, so you could potentially put in an order for a limit so you could, you know, get the price you want and you click send and it doesn't even happen because you're still set to day or mark or day, time enforced day, right? Then what happens is when the market opens, ding, 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 if the price is at or below your limit order, it will instantly buy it for you right away. And you may not have wanted that. You thought it didn't buy it pre-market. You're frustrated. What the hell's going on? The market opens. It then buys it for you. And you're like, shit, I didn't actually want to buy it anymore because Evan said now it tanked. Don't even buy that anymore. And now I've bought it. And uh, now what? Right. So that can happen. Uh, so you have to go to your orders and cancel it. If you, When you make an order, if it doesn't get filled, it's still sitting out there for some reason. So you need to get in there and, and adjust that and uh, go to your orders and cancel it or adjust it, change it to the time and force you really, really want. Pre-order, pre-market orders cancel just as quickly, yeah, because they're through your brokerage. Uh, so yes and no, but yeah, m m the... The um, uh, the best answer is yes, it's about the same, but there are some scenarios where it's, you know, what you're interested interested in is is something um, out of the ordinary, and it's being routed in a in a strange way, so it may take a little bit of another few seconds or something, but it'll be okay.